Hello everyone and thanks for joining me for another project overview. If you remember, I already had this kind of suitcase which was created with the Graphic 45 Sunkiss paper collection and uh, that suitcase uh, is not with me anymore as it was sent to Graphic 45 uh, for uh, Creativation 2018 um, show and I don't have it anymore so I just needed to create one for myself and this is the suitcase that I have right now which has been completed using the papers from Blue Fern Studios the collection was called Seaside Cottage and I think it's a pretty old collection from 2016 um, and uh, this is why I'm here today. I want to show you the uh, finished uh, vintage uh, suitcase with an album inside and the design of this project is completely the same including the dimensions like um, the one that I've created earlier with the Sunkist collection. So uh, let's have a look at this suitcase. It also has uh, D-rings attached to the sides and this is how the front of it looks like with the little tag here uh, attached to one of the handles. The handles are also wrapped with a cord. I have a few charms attached to another D-ring here uh, on the front of the suitcase. The same label holder like the one that I had in the previous version and this is the back with two uh, quite long hinges. Let's open up the suitcase and this is how the inside of it looks like. There is a pocket with a few tags on the inside uh, of the top uh, section of the suitcase. Some cut out embellishments and this is the album with the binding and the spine which looks like this wrapped in uh, canvas fabric. Let me show you closer the, um, the front cover of the album with a few um, die cuts which are by the way from Lowell and Crafts and they're sea themed so I guess they match pretty good to um, the sea themed collection from Blue Fern. So the design of the pages once again is the same like um, in the Sunkist album. Here is a belly band that can hold a couple of pictures and the template that I have here is 4 by 6 inches. Each one of the pages has a photo mat and two more pictures can be uh, glued down to the um, to that mat. I think the uh, three and a half by five inch picture actually can look better here. This is how the uh, three and a half by five inch picture will look like on the mat. Like that. This was the first page and this is the next uh, spread of the album pages. We have the flaps which open to the sides like that and each one of those flaps has a little pocket on the front which can hold either tags or more uh, smaller uh, sized pictures. Once again a photo mat inside the page and here we have vertical belly bands pictures can be put behind the belly bands on both sides of the spread. Then we have two horizontal pockets here with more uh, space for either pictures or tags or both and this is how I embellished the pockets pretty simple 
with some uh, cutouts from the paper collection and um, a few die cut pieces once again from Lala Land Crafts. One more photo mat inside a pocket style page of the album. Then we have the pocket here for larger pictures and we have another pocket for smaller pictures or uh, tags and the same on this side as this is a mirrored reflection of this page so a pocket here and a pocket here and there is one more photo mat inside the page and then we get to the last page of the album which is the reflection and the same design of the first one on the cover we have a vertical pocket for more pictures this is how the back looks like so this is um, the project that I've recently finished and I really like um, this style of the suitcase the album fits inside and um, you can add even more cards or um, ATC cards or some more uh, tags that you create to this suitcase as we have also the depth of this top section so you can just put it, everything on top of the album and the suitcase will still close without a problem I have a tutorial available for uh, creating the suitcase and it can be purchased through my blog. If you are interested, I will post the link in the description box down below so you can just click on that and get to the post with all the details. That tutorial is as usual in video format. It has three parts of detailed explanations as for um, putting the suitcase together and embellishing it with the hardware and um, these uh, strips of paper that I have um, around the suitcase. Um, I also explain how to create and wrap uh, with the cord um, the handles and of course it has the process of creating a mini album with all the measurements um, with putting together the binding for it and so on and uh, there will be a kit available for uh, specifically this version of the suitcase um, with the blue fern studios uh, papers and uh, it's available from uh, photographs and memories i will post the link to the store in the description box down below as well that's all for now and thank you so much for watching guys and if you have any questions you're welcome as usual to ask them uh, in the comments below. I will try to get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks and bye!